Thank you, Craig. Um, John, the president said that if Iran or its proxies attacked U.S. troops, that we would respond. So what is he waiting for exactly? He did say that. Where's the response? He said that. And he said that we so will... Repeating the warning is the response? Jackie, come on now. It's not his question. I'm not going to telegraph punches here from the podium. We have responded and retaliated in the past quite aggressively, in fact, back in March. And as the president said, uh, we will not hesitate to protect our troops and our facilities, but we're going to do it at a time of our choosing and a manner of our choosing. And the decision to do it, if we do it, is his as commander-in-chief and his alone. He said that he issued a warning to the Ayatollah this morning he talked about yesterday. How was that warning delivered? I'm not going to get into that. Can you say if there was a phone call or if there was a third party? Was there a message that was relayed after U.S. troops were injured? There was a direct message relayed. That's as far as I'm going to go. And then why were the injuries not disclosed until Tuesday? I'd have to refer you to the Pentagon. 